<clears throat> Some got a friend in me beyond the sea. You got a friend Somewhere in me waiting for me. When the road looks rough ahead and your miles and miles from the nice warm friendships, just go send your mobile say. Happy New Year! Just kidding. I've already posted a video since New Year. I'm a sucker for a good makeup collab. More so a good nostalgic makeup collab. Bows get me like really hyped up. I love them. As you've probably seen because I've tried a few on, on here. Is that the heat? It's been snowing outside so you may hear the heat going. I usually turn off the air or the heat. Um, but it's 30 degrees and I can't do it without heat for five minutes because I'm a baby. For Christmas, I got a bunch of stuff from a Pixar makeup collab. Yes. What company was it with? Ulta Beauty. It was like the Ulta Beauty brand, but they collabed with Pixar. And it is so cute. So yeah, I got all this stuff for Christmas, so I didn't even have to buy it, which was awesome, which made me love it even more. Kids could like it too, but adults could love it too. Because it's like movies that would be nostalgic for people my age. So I haven't even looked at it since I got it. So it's going to be kind of surprising to me because I have a really bad memory. So yeah, I guess we can just go ahead and start. I have like all kinds of brushes in case I need it. This is so fun. I love like playing with makeup. I'm so fun. <coughs> <coughs> they also have like skincare stuff, which is cool. It's three different sleeping masks. Oh, so you wear them when you sleep. Oh, so you just leave it on your skin overnight. I've actually never done a sleeping mask before. And I'd be willing to do that because, you know, it's the winter. It was snowing today. And we need some moisture. And the little pastel colors. An aqua sleeping mask. It has the little Monsters Inc. logo. We scare because we care, you know? They do care. They care about our faces being moisturized. Oh, that smells good. Okay. So tonight I'm going to use one of these. This one's an avocado face mask. Okay, influencer. And this one has little helmet. Does it smell like avocado? That one smells good too. It just smells like skincare. I like how there's not too much fragrance in it. This is a rose hip face mask and this one has an eye on it oh is this the what's her face celia queen celia i love her schmootsy poo when i saw this bag it was over for me it was over for me the girls that get it get it and the girls that don't don't the girls got it with this one look at this makeup bag it's so cute. It's denim. And it says, you got removed with little sheriff's badges on it. And then it says Pixar on the back. I love the shape of this too, because I feel like this could easily fit in like a bag or a suitcase. And I don't have one like this. So I think this will be perfect. For me i forgot the inside look it's a little cow prince like i can't do this anymore like i can't go on any longer as you can see i need a little bit of blush it's called hide and shriek so they have mike wazowski on the front with the little helmet and it's like a shimmery shade and more of a matte shade so let's do a Swatch first. Okay. Oh, I like this. It seems like it's very natural and I like the color. So let's see. Let's use our blush brush. Let's try the matte first. Okay, 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 okay. I've seen everyone being like, you only need to put blush up here. But I'm like, I want to put it on the apples of my cheeks. So I'm not going to listen to you. 
because the blush that I use now, like I need to let it go. I need to let it go, but for some reason, like I just can't let her go. It gets everywhere when I use it. You're gonna have to vacuum around the area where you used it because it's broken and it's like powdery grr. It's so sad because if you go back in my videos, I'm sure you can see like, you used this in 2014, Mads. You Blush, oh, see some of it already fell out. And the mirror, non-usable. Maybe we could use a different brush for the highlight kind of side. And we can just do this kind like up here. Okay, girly, you're doing a lot. <laughs> um, you made me hate this city. Let's try, I have three eyeshadow palettes. Ow. I'm so excited, guys. They're so adorable. I start sobbing and you're like, clicks off. A Finding Nemo one, a Toy Story one, and a Monsters Inc. one. You can't even see them. And look how cute the little designs on there are. See, it's like understated, like low key. It's not like childish looking to me. I don't know, like I just like the way they look. Um, you're gonna like the way you look. Anytime I say like or look in the same sentence. So this one's called Fish or Friends. Not food. Fish are friends. Not food. This is the palette. Y'all are gonna freak out when you hear the names of the shades. Okay, this one's called We Scare Because We Care. And this one looks like this. And the little flowers like on her door. I'm I don't know how I'm gonna use all these shades, but I will. Oh, and then this one's called You Got Friend Me. This one is the most like, I guess you would say natural or just like basic browns, except for that one bright mint green, which I think is really cute actually. Okay, let's figure this out. Nice mats. I kinda wanna try the Finding Nemo one first. There's like a light tan color, which is called 42 Wallaby Way. If you get it, you get it. I love like niche jokes that like not everyone gets. Me thinking that not everyone has seen Finding Nemo. Just the dirt from my brushes rubbing into my eyelid. Anemones. Which I think is the color of an anemone. Can you say that three times fast? An anemone, an anemone, an anemone, an anemone, an anemone, an anemone. We're gonna use the same brush. So that's a little bit more of like a pinkish color. Half full. We'll use, um, oh, hello. Mr. Grumpy Gills. And half full on like the out outer corner kind of it's kind of like an orangey color so the rest of the colors are kind of more you know different like in your face kind of colors what color is dark and mysterious is it black i think it is black i think i'm gonna do that for the eyeliner all the shiny colors p sherman sea cucumbers squishy and natural blue and clownfish. So those are all sparkly colors. I love all the names. Oh, what a picture together. So cute, clear. Maybe I'll try the sea cucumbers, which is like a silver sparkly color on the inner corner right here. Just for fun, cause why not? This would have been a good like New Year's color because I went somewhere definitely and like had so much fun because I went somewhere. P. Sherman. I remember when I thought I was so cool because I memorized them being like, P. Sherman, 42 Wally B. Way, Sydney. Even though they say it like 800 times in the movie. So you like are forced to memorize it. We'll mix Clownfish and Hold My Fin. Those are both like darker shimmery colors. That's pretty cute. There we go, guys. And then we have like a couple of colors that I really don't know what to do with them. 
So we have blue and yellow. Maybe I could do a little bit of blue like over the lash line for no reason. Okay, why is this actually like a look? Let's put a little bit under. Let's be crazy. That picture of that girl with fr like frozen tater tots <laughs> on her head and the captions like, she's so crazy is like, honestly everything i want to be and then with the yellow let's see should i do a little bit of yellow below the brow hold your horses okay let's do a little bit of yellow oh that's a pretty yellow it's called sydney here's the first one. Oh yeah we were gonna do the liner do a little wing that I probably should not have done. I always do my eyeliner like this anyway, like with the shadow, just cause it looks more natural. I think I saw like one person do that and then I was like, this is the only way to do it. Okay, the yellow was a bit too far. I think that was like a step too far. I really like this, like especially for the price, I think it's a really good palette. So you can, you can be wild. Or you can be tame. I also got two little lip sets. And this one's called Let's Ride Cowboy. It has a lip gloss and a lip liner. Kylie Lip Kit. Better watch out. This is this outsold Kylie Lip Kit. Ride em Cowboy outsold Kylie Lip Kit. This one has a little... Hello? This is like 98% of these videos. A little sheriff's badge. And this one has a cactus on it. Really cute. I was like, can it sit up? And it can, but it's like rounded at the bottom. Iconic. See, this is where I need to venture out more is like lip colors. I haven't found like my perfect fave lip color. I use one of those Barbie ones like almost every day. Honestly though, that was, that was everything. Oh, it smells so good too. Wow. That smells so good. Gotcha. What is it? It smells like Jolly Ranchers. I like the color actually. Okay, wait, hold on. See, that could be an insta pick. If you cover up this eye and then someone would zoom in on it and be like, is that yellow under your eyebrow? And I'd be like, yes. If you like, for any reason, were kissing someone, like if you have a boyfriend or whatever, then this would be a great thing to get because it would be like, whoa, what's that? I don't have to worry about that. But like, if you want to do that, that would be cool. Um, they'd be like, Vari, what was that? Did you just have some Jolly Ranchers? And you're like, no, nope, it's getting up, cowboy. <laughs> I cannot for the life of me remember the name of that lip product. <laughs> now let's use We Scare because we care. This one has like a lot of more chunky glitter. <laughs> Okay, so we're gonna use Scream Shortage, which is just like a basic base color. And then, boo! <laughs> boo exclamation point. There's like a dark brown color that's called 2319. 2319! We have a 2319! <laughs> Me, anytime anyone has a sock on, Let's use scary feet under the brow. Cause it's kind of like a shiny, like this would be one that you would actually use like under the brow, I think. And then kid catastrophe and sleep tight. These are like darker brown colors that we're gonna use on the outside. Oh, that's pretty. That was a lot. It's really pretty. Kitty, did we use kitty? Girl, we gotta use kitty. Let's just use that on the inner corner. Let's use Mike Wazowski and Peekaboo. We'll use that more on the outside. Is that dry skin? I think so, good. And there's a purple sparkly color, which I think is really cute. It's called Roar. We'll do that on the lash line too. Let's do that. There's an eyelash in there, all right. That's my glitter eye. See, if I keep saying that this is my glitter eye, like glitter will actually go into my corneas and I'll regret saying that. That was like my smoky eye vibe. 
and that's like a glitter eye bite. Me having 20 layers of glitter on there and when I rub it across my eye, it sounds like sandpaper. And I kind of love it. Oh, so I had to remove this eye of makeup. I was really sad to say goodbye to the yellow under eyebrow look because it was growing on me. It was actually really growing on me. And if you see a lot of people wearing it in the future, then you can come back to this video and be like, Madison, Madison did that. She was ahead of her time. So I have another lip set and this one's called just keep swimming which is really cute and this one has like glitter it has a little what's its name what's the little octopus name or the squid i don't want to look at squishmallows pearl oh i forgot about that i think i had a toy that was pearl if you type in squid the first thing that comes up is squid game on roblox This was it. It was a McDonald's toy. <laughs> you squeezed the ear of it and it squirted water out. I'm about to buy, purchase this on eBay. Funny the things that we remember that fill up our headspace, that take up space in our brains. I think that's a worthwhile thing to keep in your brain though, honestly. Okay. This one has Dory on it. Very glitterific. Oh, this one's a clear gloss. Okay. Ew, the mouth noises I make, I'm like, oh. <laughs> If I do so to myself, those are some juicy lip glosses. Those are some juicy lip glosses. <laughs> I don't know. It's 11 p.m. You got a friend in me. So speaking of you got a friend in me, the name of this palette. like that if you wanted the most natural basic palette i would say that this one is of course other than that one like mint color first i'm gonna use space ranger yeah i guess it's more of a white is it white these box lights are gonna make me have eye issues um yeah i guess i'd say like a cream woody which is like an orangish color over that. Sector 12, huh, it's kind of like a greenish color. I've never really seen a color like that for eyeshadow. It's like that color. That's pretty though. Bullseye, the first thing I thought of when I read Bullseye was the Allie and AJ song. You hit the bullseye, baby. That's a great album if you haven't listened to it. Now we'll try some Andy. Yeah, these are all like pretty like, you know, neutral basic colors. We'll use Star Command. Or maybe we'll do that under the eyebrow. We'll go a little more low key with under the eyebrow. Star Command, Howdy Partner. We'll use that on the inner corner. It's more of like a gold, but that's fine. Cute, I like that. Yeehaw and favorite deputy. You can do whatever you want. Makeup is a free for all. And that's what I like about it. Cause it's art and you can't question art. And this is art. My camera's about to die. Morph. I wish I was brave enough to step foot outside my house like this. <clears throat> Mrs. Nesbitt. Who's Mrs. Nesbitt? I'm a Pixar fake fan, I guess, because I don't remember anyone's names, but I don't remember anyone's names in general. It's not because I don't care. It's because my head space is being filled with more important things like a McDonald's toy I used 20 years ago. And then Buzz Lightyear, which is like the coolest like mint color. I guess we'll use that under my eyebrow too. A little mint moment under the eye. Oh, that's kind of cool. Wait, hold on. That Buzz would be proud. Buzz Lightyear and Buzz Aldrin. Hey, I have to be kind of quiet because it's three o'clock in the morning. So I just got a shower. Shout out to my night shower people. Let's wash my face, put on toner, did all that. And the million dollar question is. Do I put on moisturizer before the mask or just the mask? I did a little Google Google search. Didn't help. Didn't help in the slightest. 
I think I'm gonna do it instead of moisturizer, okay? I kinda wanna try the Aqua because Aquamarine is a great movie. Okay, so here we go, guys. We're just gonna like rub it in. It's very thick. I'll let you know in the morning how it worked. The stool cut vibes. Don't look at me. Uh, oh my goodness, don't look at me. So my face does feel very like moisturized. It feels very aqua, if you will. I like it. Madison approved. Something that smells good instead of a candle, you can just leave this open. 